I am celebrating one year of candle making process. I usually use these three waxes whenever I am working. For a better quality, I use soil wax. Second would be the wrapped wax from the plant. And for cheaper candles, it's the paraffin wax. I use colors and scents and silicone molds. Here is a video of my husband giving a review. Yeah, no, they blend better. That's what I was talking about. Mm -hmm. yeah. And even, you know, it has some... Why you didn't make this a small orange from the thing? Yeah, I know that should oh, yeah? be orange. Yeah, this should have been orange, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Isn't it orange? Even it's a pumpkin. But it is. No, but it doesn't smell like orange. Oh, maybe I forgot. No. Why does it have this thing on it, this pattern? Yeah, I know, right? Mm -hmm. It's a cool yeah, and exactly. how it cooled. Mm -hmm. yeah. yeah, yeah. Yeah, that's cool. So it's not orange? Nope. <laughs> what? Orange. Let me smell. You have some oil that I says want this orange one. something. Yeah, that one just looks <laughs> bad as well, sir. I really love the lavender and eucalyptus. Oh, really nice one? Yeah, man. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Cool. <laughs> Alright, thank you, gentlemen, yeah, the people. Shit. Ooh, look at all this. This one's too warm. It smells like cake. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Oh my goodness! Yeah, no, what? I swear. What, what is, is in here? I smell like cake. One cake. What is in here? <laughs> Some mixture make it smell like one and plus the one. You it cannot smell like, like no. It smells like tomato, man. <laughs> I swear. It's but like tomato smell good. Yeah, exactly. Baby, no, you cannot. Like it's this vanilla in this cashmere. Cup, right? You know you cannot like this in this cup, right? What is that? You know this cup will burst. Um, for a little bit, you can light it and put it out. You don't keep it on, like. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you can this one like that too. You don't burn it. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so they, they, yeah, they're cool. Yeah, no, they're cool. Oh, they're cool. Yeah, the colder ones, you don't really get the scent till you burn them. Mm -hmm. But this one is still you can put Mm-hmm. Yeah, see, like this one, this one looks even cooler. You can make a nice yellow one out of it, and then it does look like a hive. Yeah, too. With the other one, it's mm -hmm. too. But wasn't I? Wasn't translucent. it yellow? Which one? No, I'm saying if you make a yellow one with I this know, material. I always. Yeah. <laughs> but yes. With uh -huh. that substance. Yeah, I didn't know which So babe, should I sell these ones? I already. I looked away. I'm gonna sell these ones. So if you don't like any, if you want one to buy, purchase it. I want that pink one and blue one. I know. I want the lavender. And you see my toys that I had to make my candles and stuff, burn away the stuff, you guys finished it. Don't <laughs> Okay, while reviewing the video, I realized that I'm trying to sell my husband candles after he purchased all the <laughs> all the products needed. For the candle making. <laughs> Anyways, but I guess that's the business me getting into the business mode. Those were my first set of candles. They were a success, and yeah, I was very proud. The colors were popping, the scents were there. You heard them. They were just judging and giving their honest opinion. I didn't really know what to do. It's the honest, raw, uncut. It's the truth of how it was and it's been a year so of course i have made improvements as well and i'll i have the latest video in the end so you can just continue watch as i unmold candles and be so excited that they came out good because i don't know i have seen so many videos on youtube with candles and i said let me give it a try because in germany where i'm at i don't see these artisan candles like i see them in america so i just wanted to bring them here in my region 
and I like candles we always do candle rituals candle magic we work with the element fire and we always pray with candles you know it's one of the major elements and here are my recent candles I incorporate herbs plants and essential oils and it's just like more of a magical thing nowadays than just like basic stuff it's more taken seriously for ritualistic purposes and ceremonies and i just wanted to share this video so you can see the progress that if we do not start we won't know where anything will take us and yeah i encourage you today to start so you can have something building for yourself something creative something that is yours to work on it doesn't have to be serious even as hobbies it, you can make candles in not only um, jars and things for this one I use even coconut shell you can use clay pottery you can use peels of citrus fruits you can for example orange peels grapefruit peels you can use so much different things for candles it's just crazy so this is something I like to work with because of the versi of how versatile it is I can make so many different candles with different colors 